Happy Monday everyone. Wintry weather does continue for some as we go over the next couple of days, but most of us trending towards what we normally see a bit more of this time of year. That's just straight up rainfall. Snow levels bumping up as a warm front tries to move on through. It'll actually stall out about halfway through the forecast area, moving in essentially from south to north, which means at times it's going to be colder in Douglas County and it is further off to the south. Not usually the case out there, bringing the potential snow down to the basin floor in Douglas County but more mainly rainfall for areas like the Rogue Valley, Illinois Valley as we go through tonight into tomorrow. So a warm front tonight bringing that potential of showers, bumping up temperatures a little bit for most of us once again, but lower snow levels for Douglas County. Showers likely mainly in the morning, then things clear out a little bit as the day goes on. Still some lingering showers possible into Wednesday morning, and then we start to cool down quite a bit. Thursday and Friday morning, a lot of areas, just about everybody, even areas out towards the coast, seeing the potential of well below freezing temperatures. We'll stay mostly dry though Thursday and a good part of Friday, but late Friday into the weekend, another system rolling on in and it's trending mainly towards the warmer side of things, so trending mainly towards rainfall towards the weekend. But before that happens, we've got tonight on the coast cloudy, rainy, 30s and 40s for your lows, 40s and 50s for your highs, a winter storm warning above 3,000 feet once you get into the higher elevations like the Kalmyopsis Wilderness and eastern Curry County. For the West Valleys, cloudy, breezy with rain and snow, but snow mainly above 3,000 feet. However, that does involve some major mountain passes, Siskiyou Summit for example, could see the potential of additional snow and areas further to the north. Douglas County, Roseburg seeing that chance of snow with that warm front stalling out right around the Grants Pass Medford area. And if it does, that means snow potential down to the basin floor in the Umpqua Basin itself, but mainly rainfall in other areas as we get into the day on Tuesday. And for areas east of the Cascades, mostly cloudy snow showers and breezy winds, 20s and 30s for your lows, 30s and 40s for your highs. Winter storm warning does continue there through 4 p.m. with snow early, then a little bit of a mix of rain and snow showers as we we'll warm up slightly towards the afternoon. Rain, then lighter rain showers for your Tuesday for the Rogue Valley. Chance of showers early Wednesday. That's about it for a few days. Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday bring in another chance of showers. That'll continue with a few chances Sunday and Monday. For the basin snow, then a mix of rain and snow showers. Chance of snow early Wednesday, mostly dry before the weekend, brings a chance of rain and snow Saturday. Northern California, chance of rain and snow Tuesday and Wednesday, and then mainly rain showers towards the weekend. A little breezy at times as well. And out on the coast rain and then lighter showers into Wednesday showers return and with higher winds towards Sunday and Monday.